गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट नेक्स्ट सब टॉपिक न्यूक्लियस सो प्रीवियस क्लास वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट सेल मेम्ब्रेन एंड साइटोप्लासम सो इन दिस सेक्शन वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट न्यूक्लियस सो द न्यूक्लियस इज वन ऑफ द इम्पोर्टेंट कॉम्पोनेंट्स ऑफ लिविंग सेल्स सो सेल मेम्ब्रेन साइटोप्लास न्यूक्लियस इट्स ए वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट कॉम्पोनेंट्स ऑफ लिविंग सेल्स सो फर्स्ट हु डिस्कवर द न्यूक्लियस द रॉबर्ट ब्राउन ही डिस्कवर द न्यूक्लियस सो इट इज जनरली स्पेरिकल एंड लोकेटेड इन द सेंटर ऑफ द सेल सो इट इज वेर वेल लोकेटेड इट इज य लोकेटेड इन स्पेरिकल से in center of the cell it can be stained and seen easily with the help of microscope so the nucleus you know you can easy to find out using the stain the help of the microscope the help of that microscope nucleus is separated from the cytoplasm by a membrane is called the nuclear membrane so nucleus is separated from the cytoplasm cytoplasm la rendu thaniya irukkoodiyathu nucleus okay va nucleus is separated from cytoplasm by a membrane called the nuclear membrane this membrane is also porous and allow the movement of material between the cytoplasm and inside the nucleus okay so some substances is very important for that nucleus so this membrane which membrane the nuclear membranes is also porous and allow the movement of the material between the cytoplasm and inside that nucleus you know some material it can transfer from cytoplasm to nucleus so with the use of magnifying microscope we can see in the smallest spherical body in the nucleus it is called the nucleolus so the nucleus where a nucleolus where okay so the nucleus mean it is a smaller spherical body inside the nucleus and the nucleus kulla or chinna da or spherical shape la irukum that is called nucleolus in addition the nucleus contain thread like structure is called chromosome so adu illama the nucleus contain the thread like structure is called chromosome it is a very important the chromosome means nothing but the nucleus contain the nucleus contain the thread like structure is called chromosome so these carry genes and carry help in inheritance or transfer of character from parent to offspring so what is the main role of the gene so gene where will present inside the chromosome ku irukiradha gene so this carry genes and help in inheritance or transfer the character from parent to offspring so ipo unga appa kuda irukkoodiya character ungalku transfer pannidadana in the gene so this gene and help in inheritance of transfer characters from the parent to that offspring the chromosome can be seen only when the cell divides so it is very important so when we will see in chromosome so chromosome seen only during the cell division time only cell division time only gene gene is a unit of inheritance in living organism so on like this word the gene is a unit of inheritance of living organism it control the transfer of hereditary characteristic from parent to offspring so it control the transfer of a hereditary character a hereditary ca- character means parambara parambara varakkoodiya character hereditary means from the one generation to next generation so hereditary character from parent to offspring parent to offspring this means they were parent pass some of the characteristic on you 
சொல்லுவாங்க ஒரு பார்த்தா அவங்க அப்பா மாதிரியே இருக்கலாம் அவங்க அம்மா மாதிரி இருக்குன்னு சொல்லுவாங்களா ஸோ பிகாஸ் த சம் அதுக்கு மெயின் ரீசன் சம் ஜீன் அதுக்கு மெயின் ரீசன் வாட் ஜீன் ஸோ வாட் இஸ் த மெயின் ரோல் ஆஃப் ஜீன் த ஜீன் இஸ் ட்ரான்ஸ்ஃபர் த இன்ஹெரிட்டன் கேரக்டர்ஸ் ஃப்ரம் பேரண்ட் டு ஆஸ்ட்ரிக் ஃபார் எக்ஸாம்பிள் யுவர் ஃபாதர் ஹேஸ் ப்ரௌன் ஐஸ் யூ மே ஆல்சோ ஹேவ் ப்ரௌன் ஐஸ் and your mother has curly hair you might also end up having the curly hair however the different combination for genes from parent result the different character so or living or or living or the form aagana definitely or male female irukum okay va adar mooliyama da and or organism form aagum bodhi so that is a sexual reproduction so you have some character from your parent to offspring for example your father has that brown eyes you also has the brown eyes and your mother has the curly hair that time you also have the curly hair nucleus in addition to its role in inheritance act as control center of the activities of the cell so the nucleus is additional addition to its role in the inheritance act as control center of the activities of cell okay and the numbers nucleus enna panudha appadina the cell ku ullu nadakkoodiya character activate pandradhuna in the cell the center of the activity of the cell the entire content of a living cell is known as called the protoplasm so the entire content the entire content of living cells is known as the protoplasm it include the cytoplasm and the nucleus protoplasm is called the living substance in the cell so protoplasm is called the living substance of the cell okay so the entire content of living cells is known as called the protoplasm the entire living cell cell ena solran protoplasm solran its include the cytoplasm and the nucleus including the cytoplasm the nucleus yethe mena solran protoplasm solran the protoplasm is called the living substance of the cell so the protoplasm is called the protoplasm is called the living substances of the cell okay thank you students